this is the fourth or the fifth time that I've tried this marbling paper process and it's the first time that it actually worked and I was able to reasonably predict what the outcome was going to be. Uh, I've watched so many videos and it looked so easy, but it wasn't. I mean, you have this sizing here, which traditional marble papers, marble maker papers, marble paper makers, they use a, a they cook Irish moss, carrageenan down for a few hours and strain it. And uh, they use ox gold. It's, it's all very complicated. But I found a way where you can use stay flow starch. Uh, and then you have alum, some kind of chemical that you sponge onto the papers to make them a little more absorbent. So I kept drawing and it wasn't working, but every time I did it, I had a little more success. And uh, the secret is you have to get up. Hold on. Don't go away, papers. If you don't get the inks right, they don't spread out or they sink to the bottom and you use a dispersant. And I find you could use dish soap. But anyway, I'm going to show you what I'm doing. Okay, yes. Very good. I got a new batch here. I'm dropping some black in. And you see, it sort of spreads out. It's not perfect. Come on baby hmm I think I need a little more water in here yeah that's gonna help there they go okay yeah a little black and they say to use the darker colors first Oh, you know, I know what I did wrong here. I used that cold water. Okay, that's all I could do. That's why it worked before. I kept, okay. Now the red's spreading out pretty good, see? But I, you gotta try and keep everything the same temperature. And I used some of that rain water by mistake. Oh well, okay. There's some reds. Let's flick a little purple on and some white. Yeah, too cold, but you'll see what's happening anyway. Okay. Now we got a piece of this paper that I've treated with alum. I'm gonna lay it on there. Get these air bubbles out and let it sit for a second or two. And I'm going to pull this baby out. Oh, yeah. Okay. No, the water was too cold, but it's all right. You sort of have an idea of what's going on. <laughs> 